Sydney Harbour dinner cruise tonight. The boat is actually just behind us. It's just got here. I think they're having, you know, some tidying and cleaning and probably getting some food on board for us when we sail at five. We have to drink this before it's time for our cruise. So we will catch you when we're boarding the ship. Guys, I'm just gonna see if I have to check in with my ticket on my phone. I don't see anyone sat at the ticket desk. It's just here. Hello. Hello. Hi. Oh, <laughs> I didn't. I didn't see the bell. You can I show the tickets now? Um, okay. It's sponsored in our with the window guarantee seating uh -huh. for two people. Yes. Mm -hmm. I booked at the 5 p.m. sunset dinner cruise with guaranteed window seating. Champagne, beers, wine, red wine, coffee and tea. I'm very excited. They showed us the menu and apparently it's alternate. So I think they serve like one of each. Oh no, actually I think what it is, all dishes served alternatively. And you get one of each. Is that it? Yeah. Definitely? Yeah. So I feel oh, like is it you get one and I get one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, I get it. Okay, that's good. So at least that means we get to try everything because I always steal some of Brad's anyway and he always steals some of mine. So it's fine. What do you want to drink, babe? Wasted money on curious. Forgot how to fix myself. They say that time is free. Then why is it so precious? The Matrix. <laughs> Right, you can put your arm around me and say, I like you're the boss. Act like I'm the boss. <laughs> I'm gonna wave to this ferry, see if anyone waves back. Yeah. Ready? Yeah! <laughs> 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 Okay guys, so I have the smoked salmon with herb salad, um, things like that. And then Brad has the crispy pear and garden leaf salad with walnuts and um, parmesan cheese. So this is the start, right? Yeah. Should we tuck in? Yes, I'm, I'm, I'm starving. Let's go, tell me how the salmon is. Okay. No? It's good. You can't go wrong with smoked salmon. Now I'm trying pear salad. So I've never actually had pear salad before, so... Interesting. It's like pear, but it's like... It has a vinaigrette on it, I think. I think it's like a... An eight? A seven or an eight? It's good, it's good. Dinner time. <laughs> Sit down, honey. What have we got? We have chicken with pumpkin and uh, like greens and vegetables, potatoes. And you have barramundi with a flower. <laughs> let's, uh, let's tuck in and we're going to give you an honest review of the food after. Now for the chicken. Here we go. Let's see. It all looks succulent. Nice. Yeah? Right, very good. Okay, what's your rating out there? <laughs> For the flavours and the taste, this is a nine. A nine? Yeah? It's very good. Walking wow. on some lemon. Tash, what dish is that? So this is barramundi, which is a type of fish. Some sort of sauce there. Peppers. Just, kind of just tastes like cod. Nice. Yeah. yeah. Rain out there. Which one do you prefer? The chicken dish here? Or do you prefer the fish dish here? I think I prefer the chicken. Yeah. I'm more of a chicken person than I am fish, but this is very nice. Okay, so let's give the uh, let's give the fish a rain out there. 
the fish, I would give it a solid 8. 8 out of 10, that is a good score, right? So the tables in there have actually got like white um, cloths on the table, so that obviously must be the really fancy place where you eat dinner. One thing guys, I booked it um, thinking that there would be live entertainment on the ship and it seems there is, but um, we're actually sat in the one part of the ship where you can't see the live entertainment. So, bear that in mind guys. Oh well, there we go. Thank you Enjoy guys. Wow. Thank you. Right, we need to see what this is Brad. This is lemon and lime tart with a dollop of ice cream oh no a dollop of double cream and yours is a chocolate raspberry coconut pebble with raspberry sauce this is the lemon tart try some mm. Mm. Ah, very lemony very very lemony next we have the chocolate and raspberry pebbles <sighs> It's, yeah, it is like a very thick, have a look guys, it's like a very thick mousse, so this, this is way too much on my spoon. Um, wow, it's rich. That's what people at our age should be on. Yeah, but we're on this one. <laughs> we're on the old people's cruise. Okay, what did you think of the cruise like? So, um, I thought it was really nice. Rating out of 10? Oh, so, it's hard. You've got to put it into categories, Brad. So, the staff were definitely 9 out of 10. Everyone was really friendly. All that way, as we um, talk. Yeah, everyone was really friendly and, you know, they were always there if you need anything, etc. Which is good, it's what you expect, right? But did we see a sunset? It was a sunset cruise. We didn't see a sunset, and I don't actually know if the sun set or not, but to be honest guys, the weather today is really bad. The weather is bad, and I don't believe the sun has set, but they might have docked early because of the weather. 150 bucks, 160 bucks, sorry. USD. USD. Was it worth it? I think... Yes to experience it, but it's probably not worth the value. No, it's probably a little bit overpriced considering you don't really get enough food to fill you up. Yeah, and we need to go to McDonald's yeah. now to fill it up. And also, I did say this earlier in the video, but if you're not sat in the main dining room on either the ocean deck or the, the club deck that we are on, you don't get to see the live entertainment that they have on a Saturday and Sunday. We would recommend you give it a go. Um, like I said, don't have your hopes too high, but if you've got a bit of spare money to spare on, yeah. on something like that, and give it a go. And also guys, it's not even that fancy. Like, I just wore this because I fancied it and I'm not even that dressed up and you don't even have to go dressy. It's not the kind of place where you need to be like proper yeah. dressed up. You can be really casual. It's just a dinner. Anyway, Billabong, wear some fongs. We'll see you soon. <laughs> see you later. Bye. Take care. Forgot how to fix myself. Ooh. They say that time.